so today I was meant to go for lunch with the girls. Yeah. But I didn't go. Wow. So um, at the weekend, we've all gone out. The night was nearing an end. And I was like, is there anywhere we can go after? And then a friend of uh, Dan's popped up and was like, you, c you can all come for a drink at mine. And I've just said, Dan, are we going? Yeah. And with that, Amber's turned around and gone to me. It's so disrespectful that you're asking Dan to come out. You can see we're having a row, 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 row. I said, I didn't see there was having a row. I really didn't. Yeah. I've just said whatever. We had a bit of a big car and I left it and got into a taxi. Got back to this after party. Half hour later, Dan has turned up on his own. And within 10 minutes, Amber started messaging me, basically saying how, as a mate, I shouldn't have been asking Dan to come. I wasn't. I was asking everyone as a collective. Why would I just be asking Dan? So what's she insinuating then? That I was cracking onto him, which is something I would fucking never do, ever. I'm a good mate to the people that are my fucking friends. And the thing is, I would never, ever sit there and ask Dan to go somewhere and not her. They yeah. come as a pair. What I don't understand with you is, is what is it that's made you feel uncomfortable before this? Because you ain't just wiping your hands because she's saying this. I've been trying to cover up the problems with her. We've not been fine since last summer. And I know that she still wants to be my friend, but I know why she still wants to be my friend, because it's easier to be my friend than my enemy. And that's it. She ain't my enemy. I don't give a f about her. You wouldn't accuse me of yeah. sticking it on your boyfriend. What are you f***ing mad? Messaging me going, do you know how sore that looks? F***ing sore. You know what? I can tell you a lot of she's things that sore. are sore and it ain't f***ing me. Honestly. The problem's a relationship, not you. I've given her way too many chances. You know, in Thailand, when yeah. you were saying to me, why are you still being friends with her? Rah, rah, rah. I could see it, I could understand everything you were saying, but I just don't, I didn't want to rock the boat. I can't be bothered. There's been so many things, and I think you cheeky to come to my face in Thailand and tell me that you're calling me out for the way I speak to people. She's projecting her problems onto everyone, I think, and that, that is her as a person. She's, we're not friends anymore. It's done.